I have to share this with you. This is a palette that I bought from Ross. I paid $3.99 for it. It is a beauty treats, it's messy a bit, it's beauty treats, natural nudes, yeah, natural nudes, eyeshadow palette. This thing, flimsy packaging, but people don't let this flimsy packaging fool you. It is an absolutely amazing package now. This is four US dollars. And elf palettes are for this thrill, the double quads that they have. Is that a two nights and a three nights and I can't remember now. Wet and Wild has new ones with five inside for $2.99. This is 12 eyeshadows. You get one, two, three, four, five, five mattes. You have six metallics, a one chunky glitter one, that's it. So matte, 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 matte. Now some people be like, oh, there's no crease color. Yeah, that's true, but for like me, that brown is brown enough for everyday wear. So I like this palette. You have pretty much six cool and six warm colors, which to me makes it perfect. Now, if I have like four eyeshadows in here, this is how I rate it. If there's at least four to six eyeshadows in here that are really great, like awesome, then this is what we, I mean, if there's one or two duds, then I love this palette and I've been wearing it for the last couple of days and today went to a burial and I chose this palette because I knew the colors would stay on. I am going to swatch on my hand in batches of four or should I just do the mats which would be five. Let's do the mats. Um, so warm, cool, and if my lighting is going to be good enough. So overcast. So the mats look like almost nothing, and I will do two layer of the mats. So that's the first. But let me tell you something. On the eyes, I swatched the mats on my hand, and I was like, "Oh, okay, they're okay." And then I applied them to my eyes. So that's the first four. And I was blown away, blown away with their performance when my brush hit it. So the last one, which is the dark one, I was making sure and tried to dry my hand. That one is like really nice brown. And I'll do two again, like I'm doing with all of them. They're buildable and I can build on them still. So that's the mats. Um, do they have a lot of kick up because a lot of mats do little staining. Um, there is fallout. Tap your brush well, and you should be fine. I didn't have a problem with a lot of extra kick up. So let me go with the shimmers. I wore I wore this one last night on my lid. Oh my gosh, so so beautiful. Looks like nothing. I find it when I swatched it. Uh, when I swatched it on my hand, it doesn't look like nothing. But on my eyes, I didn't even foil it. I just had a base on my eyes. Now, this color I have not used, but it's a nice golden color. And you can see it's picking up. This color is um, it's like a mute, it's like a rose color. I find that it kind of washes out in swatch. I've not worn to my eye, but the soft one of the softest colors is this one here. It has a lot of fallout. So let me swatch it on my hand. But that gold looks so on point and this is the color i'm wearing on my lids no need to foil literally put your brush in tap you have to tap off and then pat on your eyes can you see I, there's no need for me to build on this like literally liquid metallic color it's like really 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 now the next three which would be this which is like the chunky glitter and then this color which i'm dying to use tomorrow is really nice and then this has like a rusty warm color 
So this one, you can see the chunks there. I am kind of skeptical to use it. And then this color here, so, so gorgeous. Okay, that applied way better than I thought because I just swatched really slow. So it looks like it, it melted. The top layer, I can tell you, when I swatched last night, um, I came back really depressed after the viewing. So I was playing with this palette a little bit and swatching it in my hand and studying if I should have done a video. But that actually swatched really nice now. It's almost as if the chunkiness has disappeared. So maybe if you apply it with your hand as against a brush, I swatched last night with both fingers and brush. So you can see the metallic colors are on point. Um, the least favorite color in terms of performance definitely has to be this rose color. So this palette for me has more like 11 for me, really awesome. Oh, it's swatching really nice now. So I guess, oh, my hands are wet from the wipe. So I guess if I wet my brush, it's going to actually apply really, really well. So yeah, that was a solution to that problem. This palette is awesome for $3.99. And if you can get this even cheaper at your local beauty supply store, if you guys aren't sure that you can get this in Wonderful Wool or Pennywise, oh my word. I'm wondering if Five Below has this palette, but I'm gonna go back to Ross because I was gonna give this palette away and I said, I don't wanna give it away if I don't know the quality of it. Um, and now that I know it's amazing, I'm gonna go and look. I'm sure I may not find this, but I shouldn't say that. I really, really would like to have this and maybe put this in a giveaway. This is amazing. I may play around with it a little, play around with it a little and then give it to my sister because really and truly I do not, should not hoard anymore. I have all these colors. I'm like so tempted to send the Wet n Wild one, which I have to do a review because I love this and she's not a person that loves a lot of matte colors like I do and I love how the matte colors work here like you guys it's the matte colors are absolutely blendable great transition and in the crease color I mean I guess for some of you like the really darker darker colors then you'll be missing a nice dark dark brown or dark um, burgundy color or black but I think this part is creased if I see any others like this, maybe when I go to um, Ross again, I will take a picture. I don't know if I'll buy another one. It has to really stand out to me like this. This one did. But overall, this is an awesome palette. Under $5. $3.99. Can't go better than that. I'm absolutely loving it. So that's my video here. Hope you guys enjoyed this little review. And if you see this palette, go get it. Definitely, definitely, you won't regret it. Until my next video, take care and please be safe, guys. And don't forget, when you jump in your vehicle, to wear your seatbelt. A seatbelt saves lives.